My name is Ivanka Kran. I'm the physical therapy director at Axis Spine Center. I have two specialties, uh, one of them being manual therapy through the North American Institute of Manual Therapy, as well as an orthopedic certified specialty through the American Board of Physical Therapy. I'm from Canada, so I went to the University of Alberta in Canada, so I got my bachelor's degree there at that time, and then I went on to get my doctorate through St. Scholastica in Duluth, Minnesota. I chose my specific specialty because I'm really someone that's interested in the mechanics of how something works. To do more of the manual therapy, I really enjoy just learning the, the way the body moves, the way all the different spinal segments move, and how I can assist in restoring that to get patients back to their full function. And the orthopedic specialty certification is something that required 10,000 hours of experience and testing to gain a real thorough, broad knowledge of orthopedics. Yeah, there are other subspecialties that I have, and those are now a certification in dry needling, so that's something that's new in the physical therapy world in the last three years. That's one specialty. Another one is instrument-assisted soft tissue mobilization, so that's using different types of tools to improve fascial mobility in the body. So some of my proudest personal achievements have been just working towards setting some goals and then achieving them. So I was one of the first female smoke jumpers in Canada uh, many years ago while I was going to PT school. And then probably more recently over the last 20 years, especially being here in Coeur d'Alene, um, I've completed over 20 full Ironmans. I chose to come to work at Access Spine Center because it was an opportunity to develop and grow a physical therapy program with an emphasis on collaboration to really move to that next level of patient care in the community. Gosh, over the years there's so many memorable experiences, but the things I think I enjoy is lots of times I'll get a picture later from a patient on, you know, things they've been able to achieve that we've worked towards. You know, I've got pictures of people hiking towards Crazy Horse in, you know, South Dakota. I've had, you know, 90-year-old patients say, you've given me the tools to really get back to living independently. So that's what gives me the, the most smiles at the end of the day, I guess.